we get it down to eight remarkable and truly distinctive films. The official kickoff for the Milton Film Festival began last night with the announcement of three of eight marquee films. It feels great. I'm, I'm really excited about this year's films. You know, I, every year I get a little bit worried that we're not going to be able to top ourselves and then we do. So I'm really, really happy with the way things are working out. The three films announced were Denial, featuring Rachel Weiss, the equestrian-themed Dark Horse, and a partnership with the Toronto Film Festival helped land the special viewing of Canadian film Weirdos, which is to be featured at the Milton Film Festival before its mainstream release. And so they have access to what they call pre-release films. So we get to, to have these films usually before the, the DVD release or the Blu-ray release and occasionally, as in this case, we get them before the actual wide theatre release. Film critic Ron Bass will also be returning to MC for the third time. Uh, movies are an endangered species these days. It's uh, more and more difficult to make the kind of uh, adult-oriented, uh, provocative, entertaining films that, that I grew up with. Uh, it, you know, in this era that's devoted to, you know, the big franchises and tentpole movies and, and people in tights. Uh, the kind of movies that we're showing, uh, as, as I say, are just harder and harder to make. The 2017 Milton Film Festival kicks off on January 27th, the 29th. For more tickets and information, head to MiltonFilmFest.com. For Halton Insider, I'm Hayden Narine.